um, this started as a, an excuse for me to play with processing. I was um, interested in the language. Uh, it's supposed to be for um, visual artists and uh, people who want to uh, make uh, interesting um, visual things. The first project that I made um, was this, and I think the resolution on the projector is really different than my computer, but this is the first thing I made just to play with it. Um, and then I asked Yael, you know, if there was something that would be interesting for me to do um, today, and um, he pointed me at this. Uh, he pointed me at this uh, income tax data that the um, that the IRS and the, the tax agency in the U.S. publishes, um, and they uh, they put out a lot of a lot of data, but it's all. Um, I mean, it's. It's all like this. It's all just tables that are really hard to look at. Um, so uh, I wanted to take that data and, and make it look a little bit more um, understandable. And uh, unfortunately, the resolution of this thing is really bad. Um, but the idea here is that um, for what this, what this, uh, what the spreadsheet and what this is showing you is that for for different income levels, which are these over here, for different for different income levels, um, what percentage of of the total number of people are paying that percentage as their income tax? So it's um, you can't see the bottom axis, but I thought the interesting find here was that um, there are. Uh, uh, you can't show it. Here, let me do a little live hack. What's the resolution of that thing, Zio? Zio? 1034. So, what this, what this is showing you is that, um, this was the interesting find out of all of that data, is that there are a lot of people who are making between one hundred and two hundred thousand dollars a year. There's thirty thirty-five percent of those people, which is the this part of the axis, are only paying twelve to fifteen percent of their income in income tax, which is pretty low. So anyway, this uh, the whole thing isn't isn't all that interesting, but. It was a good. It was a good exercise for me to learn processing, and I think now that I kind of have the hang of um, how to make these kind of charts and how to do interesting things in processing, I'll be able to get more out of that data and kind of make that data more accessible than this, which is hard to look at. So, thank you.